This is Tony Hickson with Hickson Zerker Capital Management coming to you today from the Wellness Studio downtown. It's owned and operated by Betsy Robertson where they do TRX, yoga, Pilates, and planks. So in this month's video, we're going to take a look back at February to see what economic events and what data uh, came out that drove markets. So February was a record setting month. The S&P 500 and NASDAQ both set record highs for many days throughout the month. But the most amazing was the Dow. So in January, the Dow crossed 20,000 for the first time. And in the month of February, the Dow set record highs every trading day from February 9th to February 27th. That was the longest streak of record highs that have occurred since 1987, and it's only the second time in history that that many record highs were strung together at one time. Speaking of records, I ran across a record that was broke last year by a guy in China. He did a plank, okay, it's a yoga move, it's crazy, for eight hours in one minute. I don't know why you would want to do that. I hope Betsy doesn't watch this video because she might make our class do that long of a plank. I can barely do a minute. So after seeing this guy's record-breaking attempt at a plank, eight hours and one minute, I thought I'd see if Josh could try to break that record by even more. And uh, it didn't go so well. Anyway, seeing stocks rise can cause some euphoria and a lot of good things can happen from that, but emotion really doesn't have any place in investing. Fear often sets in when stock markets are declining and greed can often set in when stock markets are rising. Bottom line, our job is to ensure that we look at the data to make sure that emotions are out of investing and that we're making good decisions for the investments that we select for our clients. So let's take a look at some of that data that came out during the month of February. The first one, we'll take a look at the, at the labor market. The labor market showed some signs of improvement. January jobs report came out during the month of February and blew estimates out of the water. Economists were predicting a certain number and, and January jobs came out a lot higher than that. There were a few soft pockets in the labor market that we're taking a look at, but nothing to be too concerned about at this point. Another data point that came out during the month was our second look at GDP. So think of GDP, gross domestic product, as the total dollar value of all the goods and services that were produced by people and businesses during a period. So there are three reviews of this data point, the advanced, preliminary and final. So we got an advanced look at the number for the fourth quarter of 2016 and it came in at 1.9. During the month of February we got our second look and economists were hoping that that number would increase to 2.1. It didn't. It stayed at 1.9. So you could say, well that's bad, it didn't increase. Well we actually think it was good that it didn't decrease. So our GDP numbers are still very strong and we're seeing a lot of growth and positive momentum throughout various pockets of our economy. The last thing we'll look at today is President Trump. We're getting a lot of questions from our clients as to what policies and decisions he's making. How will that impact our client portfolios? And we would remind you that we're not investing in the Oval Office. We're investing in great companies that are innovating, producing great products that allow our lives to be a better, a, a better place to live. So either way, we're focused on the data. And that's what forms the foundation of our investment philosophy and allows us to make prudent and wise decisions regardless of what's coming out of Washington, D.C. We at Hicks and Zerker Capital Management are appreciative to our clients who've entrusted us to navigate these markets on their behalf. This is our 15th year in business and to celebrate that and to show appreciation to our clients, stay tuned for more details about our client event that will be coming up uh, later on this fall. That's it for this month's economic update. Again, this is Tony Hickson with Hickson Zerker Capital Management. If you have any questions regarding today's video or would like a, a free second opinion on your portfolio, please give us a call at 419-425-2400. See you next time.